Hello everyone. I have been extremely hyper fixated on Stardew Valley recently because of the new 1.6 update that just dropped. I thought that it would be fun to combine two of my special interests and design business cards for my favorite Stardew Valley characters. I originally was just gonna do them for like every single one of my favorite characters, but that list is like pretty long. Like that was like six characters and I didn't want to make six business cards because that was gonna be a lot of time. I narrowed it down to three, three of my favorite characters um, that also I just feel like would have business cards. So yeah, I also, I tried to dress up as my Stardew Valley farmer I'll put a little picture of them up here, um, but I realized I don't have brown overalls, so I just wore this shirt that's like kind of that light brown color and then my overalls. Okay, so without further ado, let's get into the designs. Full disclosure, I did already do the designs. What we're gonna do is I'm gonna show you guys like the time lapse process of me creating it and then I'm just gonna talk you through it and then show it off at the end, so. First off, we have my favorite little artsy lesbian, Leah. Okay, so also we're gonna switch to the computer camera because I need to like watch the footage. We're watching this time lapse together, besties, basically. So for each one of these cards, I started off by taking the portrait of the Stardew Valley character and putting that on there and then also picking colors off of them so that I could get their color scheme because I wanted to match the color scheme of the cards to the individual character's color scheme. For Leah's design in general, I did it based off of her art show that you can have in Stardew Valley. I also decided to name it because I don't think there's officially a name for it. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I don't think there's officially a name for it in Stardew Valley. So I decided to call it All Natural because Leah's whole vibe is kind of like, you know, earth, nature, and kind of like an in-between of like minimalist, maximalist, nature-y, foresty vibe. So that's also kind of the vibe I tried to keep with this card. I did like a nice script font, and then I decided to go green with a color for that. I ended up putting the all natural on the left, and then I had like a little decided to put a little thing above Leah's head that said works by Leah because I tried to incorporate their names in every single one of it and also like this made me really realize that they don't have last names which kind of bothered me because I wanted to put like last names on the card because it's like a business card you know um but they don't none of them have last names I also tried to incorporate her sculpture because I didn't like how empty the top was um so I tried to put her sculpture there and then I started putting like Stardew Valley Presents because I forgot that it's actually called Pelican Town. I don't know why I forgot that. I decided against putting anything up there in the end, but I really, I really do think that it looks nice. And this is what the final card turned out to look like. So second off, we have our favorite lumberjack lesbian, Robin. All these characters are lesbians. I know that canonically, like every character in Stardew Valley is like bi or pan, but like all these bitches are lesbians. So for Robin's card, I really wanted to use hardwood in the design. Like I had this very clear vision of using hardwood in the background. So this is me kind of doing that, like just duplicating the hardwood a shit ton of times and kind of just formatting them until I was happy with it. Kind of like it was like floating by, which is kind of a thing that's in Stardew Valley a few times when you have certain events where they just like have like a bunch of layovers in the background so i really just liked it and i feel like it fit robin's vibe so i did that and then i lowered the opacity and i made it more of an overlay towards the background um and then i could not for the life of me figure out a font style that i wanted for this so it took me like probably like 20 or 30 minutes of scrolling through the Adobe fonts until I finally found the fonts that I liked for this design and then I was still kind of on the edge about it. But I ended up settling on a rustic serif font and then a rustic script font. I feel like they very much give off barn vibes. Um, 
I also really had a hard time choosing the colors for this one. I wanted to do a similar thing that I did with the all natural where I have two different colors, um, but I ended up just using the same color and slightly making it, I just made it like a little bit more pink for the carpenters in the middle. And then I decided to add a bit of more information because she has the store. So I decided to add in the store information because if she had a business card, it would be on there. I really struggled with colors. I don't know why I was struggling so much with colors, but I ended up settling on, once again, that like brownish red color and then a nice light pinkish color i at first when i made this i really wasn't happy with it but like looking back on it now i really am happy with it i really like how it looks this is the final card design for robin's carpenter shop and saving the best for last we have the love of my life my sweet sweet wife penny I don't have you know this is not a safe space for Penny hate because I know that Penny is like one of the most hated romanceable NPCs. I will fight. I will fight. Penny is the love of my life. She's literally me. And I will fight every single- I will fight anyone who rags on her. So Penny's card was very very important to me obviously because she's my favorite but I also think this was one of the harder ones because I feel like going into this I had a very clear image in my head of how I wanted it to look but then when I tried to execute it I realized that I actually didn't like the design at all <laughs> so Penny if you don't know is a teacher she teaches jazz and Vincent and it doesn't really like specify what she teaches them I'm assuming it's like English teaching and this is where it really started to bother me that they didn't have a last name so i just gave penny my last name because we're married um i marry her every single time i really 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 struggled with the fonts on this one because i wanted it to be like sleek and professional but i also wanted it to be childish and like childlike because she's a children's teacher so like the majority of this was me trying to figure out both colors and fonts um did a lot of font searching as you can see but it took, it took me a hot minute to get to decide a font that i liked i also changed the background color i started off with this like minty color because i really liked it from when i did leah's card but i ended up deciding to go with like a yellow because i feel like penny just gives off a very yellow vibe like not just her character design itself but like she's just a very yellow character i also decided that it would be cool to do kind of play around with like borders um on this one i decided to add in this like nice orange border and then I gave the background like a peach color I started on doing like a brown orange color scheme and then I also added in this little line which I thought was like cool looking um, so then I changed the font color on that one to match the peachish color that's in the background I didn't mention this but I added like the lessons and when she teaches them um, and I put it as like officially like she's a part of the Pelican Town Library because like teachers they tend to have like the school district that they work for on their card but Stardew Valley or Pelican Town doesn't have a school they just have Penny so but this is the final card once again completely different from how i originally envisioned it in my head but i really really like how it turned out and those are all of the designs that i did for my favorite story valley characters i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i hope you guys like my designs if you don't shut up I want to post like a bit more design content because I love doing graphic design. Graphic design is my passion. So if there's anything like this that you guys want to see me make designs for, let me know. I hope you guys have a great day, but most importantly, don't forget to smile. Bye-bye.